Oh. How's it going guys? We got another, uh, what is this? My Strange Addiction? Yes, I'm hyped. But you know what I'm more hyped about? I just got a new dog. And he is cute as fuck. I'm gonna show you him tomorrow. Right now he's upstairs with my, uh, like, little cousin. And he's just so small and cute. I just wanna just punch him in the fucking mouth. Don't worry. Tomorrow, he's all yours. What, what's, what's the one I'm doing today? What is this? Is it, uh, I think she's eating sand. I'm very excited to watch her eat sand. Because I'm not gonna do it. Somebody's got to do it, and it's fucking her. Let's just hop right into this. I gotta do a podcast in literally 30 minutes, so let's just fucking chop right through the shit. I also have to watch it on my phone, because my fucking iPad's doing gay stuff like porn. My name is Bria. I'm 19 years old. Hello, Bria. That's a very good age, I guess. And I'm addicted to eating sand. Terrible age, I guess. I just love the crunch. And that better not be your only goddamn reason, because there's really hard cereal out there. What's what's that cereal called where it's just hard as fuck? It's literally like sand until you let it soak for about 19 hours in milk. Anybody know? I think it's called like raisin something. I don't fucking know. But this bitch should definitely try and switch, because this might not be healthy. I don't know. I'm not a doctor, so this could be really good for you. It's always good on top of food, like a seasoning or something. I like how she said, like a seasoning or something, as if seasonings don't exist. Why don't you just put seasoning on it? Let's just go keep going. I've taken a tortilla chip, dipped them in sand and ate them, and it gave the chip the best crunch that I've ever got in my entire life. I don't know, you held your face like it hurt. It's hurting me. All right, I don't want to hurt these pearly whites. And she disrespected Chipotle like that? Taking one of those beautiful chips and dipping it in fucking sand? I'm sure the sand tastes better than their queso dip though. What the hell's that? Oh my god, her chewing is just giving me cancer. I hate hearing people chew and it's just so loud. I love, they just mic it up. Great, thanks. My favorite combination of sand is when I mix it with gum. It's just like mouth watering. It's not mouth watering, your mouth is bleeding. I, the best combination is two things that cannot be digested. Great. Bria's addiction first developed five years ago when she accidentally got a mouthful of sand at the beach. She was instantly hooked on the crunchy texture. I'm glad, like in the paint one, they didn't tell how it started. At least this one, they explain how this person became a fucking weirdo. Like, I get you like the texture, that's cool. I'm sure me fucking a pumpkin would feel amazing, but you don't see me doing it every day, only when they're in season. I eat it when I go to my room, when I'm walking to class, when I'm reading a book. Before I go to bed, I put like a pinch in my mouth. When I wake up in the morning, there's still pieces, like, in my teeth. Bro, this shit is probably destroying your teeth. Like, I've heard of people fucking their teeth up from having like the toothpaste with beads on it. What is this doing? Christ! It's like leftovers. It's like leftovers? Well, leftovers are for food, so no, it's not. When I first found out that Bria was eating sand, I was like, oh my gosh, that is crazy, that's nasty. That's all you said? That's literally all you said as a friend was, oh my God, that's crazy, that is nasty. If one of my friends ever said they're eating sand, I'd be like, oh, wow, that's weird, that's crazy. Get that shit the fuck out of here! I love how they do the calculating, like, six times per day, that's 11,000 times since she began. Yeah, that sounds about right, that's honestly not impressive. When I'm craving sand, I lick my finger and then dip it inside of the sand and put it on the back of my teeth and just chew it. Sand? Sand is gross. Sand is disgusting. I don't like walking barefoot in sand. I don't even like being around sand. Now, now I 100% fucking hate it for the rest of my life. I'm just scared it's gonna get near my mouth and I'm gonna turn into addicted weirdo. I'm gonna be on the show. What, what's gonna happen to me? None of these are even realistic. She's like one of probably two people on earth. The other one died because this can kill you, I'm gonna assume. I like the fact that it grits on my teeth. It gives it that crunch that you don't get from food. See. You don't get that crunch from food because it's food. And it's not supposed to have that crunch because it's fucking food. How does her mom not just beat the fuck out of her? How do you not abort this 19-year-old? 
at, well, as she's 19. It's not a murder because she's pretty useless. Bria is so dependent on that satisfying crunch, she turns to nail files when her sand supply runs low. Oh, okay. Yeah, it just keeps getting worse. Just is way worse than sand, in my opinion. This, this is an epidemic, and it's only one person. It has like sandpaper on it that gives me the same crunch. So I put it like in the back of my teeth and just go like this. But bitch, that looks like it is painful. You are not having a good time. Stop fooling around. Stop trying to just be on this TV show. Throw all the nail files away or use them for your nails. Never go to a park again and you're fine. I just, I just healed you. You're welcome. That'll be a... Uh, any amount of money you want to give to my patreon.com slash wineboxpoppy, much appreciated. But Bria's cravings can't be satisfied with just any sand. It's gotta be that special sand, that top shelf sand right next to the Ciroc. Do you think she has them rim her glasses of alcohol with sand? That's, that's pretty sick, that'd be cool. I prefer to rim it with blow, but sand works. My favorite sand is actually the sand from the playground or a park. My favorite sand is the sand that people just piss all over. Those kids, those kids you see play at the park, yeah, they just pee all over the sand. I'm like, yeah, that gives a real musty flavor. I like tasting their iron. Does she know that people like probably her age go get drunk at that park and just throw up all over that sand? That's not even sand. That's skull. That's dried up skull. I start by taking a handful. Then I take like the big rocks out. I take the big rocks out because that's unhealthy. Don't want to fuck up my teeth. It's natural. It's straight from the earth. That's how I think of every person who likes to eat organic. It's natural. It's straight from the earth. Yes, yeah, so is this sand. So is this dick. Come get it, bitch. It's really good and it's really crunchy. All right, one of those are true. Well, it's not really good and it is really crunchy, so. At least you're not a liar. I feel like this one made me really mad. I'm inf I'm infuriated, by the way. Cause like, what what if you just are in labor, right? Like you have this kid inside you for nine months, you push this thing out of your pussy, and then 19 years later, it's like, you know what, mom? I eat sand. I don't eat ass, but I'll eat a fuckload of sand. 11,000 times since the addiction started. Like I said in the last one, if you came to a party where they're all doing cocaine, and you whip out a fat, Fat bag of sand. They're gonna be like, what the fuck are you doing? That's unhealthy. Don't put that in your body. Come do some real drugs, like a real adult. Drugs are bad, okay? I don't, I don't condone that. Whatever you want to do, though. Just, I didn't tell you to, because if you die, not my fucking fault. What are, uh, what are your summer, your weird, strange addictions? I, I make a lot of fucking shitty YouTube videos. That's my addiction. What's worse? I think mine's worse. Because then I gotta talk about this. I don't even get her name. I don't want her name, because it will ruin Everybody with the same name as sir for the rest of my life. Well, I gotta go start this podcast and just caress my brand new dog. Thank you so much for watching. Smack that face right there to subscribe if you haven't already. Two videos right here. Who, uh, who wants to come over and just rail an eight ball of sand, huh? Anybody?